Now you could investigate the power of a motor perhaps. So this is my motor over here, obviously made out of Lego. And what I have on the end is a spindle. And what I can do is put this over the edge of the table and I can then look at how quickly this mass is moved up. Now what we're going to be doing is as we move the mass up, uh, as the motor actually kind of winds round, is we're going to be increasing the amount of gravitational potential energy stored by this. We can work that out by maybe measuring the mass, we can multiply this by the gravitational field strength, g, and then we look at how long it takes to move through a certain height, h. We can then look at the total amount of energy transferred, we can use a stopwatch to record the time, and we could then work out and investigate the power of this motor.